Anything goes with the bros. Boot. The boot. The boot. Oh my god. <laughs> That, you still got the boot. I still got the boot. God damn. Yeah, I he told still you has the boot. The boot. Ooh. I've seen the boot. Have you have you took the boot yet? <laughs> huh? You haven't tried it? No. We tried. Me, him, and Dat did it. I just seen it. Oh, we man. bought the boot. I bought the boot from Hot Topic. Oh, or yeah. Or Spencer. Yeah. One or the other. One of those two. <laughs> and then the first night we took it home, we went to go buy beer and drink it. I went first. Keith went second. And Dat went third. Man. And we all finished the boot. We timed it how long it took us to finish the boot. I think I was babysitting my shit. That's a big ass boot. I, I took and me you about, did I beer? Think, I think it took me like seven minutes. To you was the fastest. Yeah. It yeah. took me like seven minutes to drink the beer. The I was whole, well, my was, you uh, can't do hard liquor. It was seven and a half bottles, right? A beer. So. It was seven and a half bottles of beer. Of the 12 ounce beer. And if you ever watch Beer Fest, I'll tell you what. That motherfucking bubble at the bottom. That shit real. That shit do exist. Yeah. <laughs> you fucking turn it, turn it. You got to turn it. <laughs> when you drink it, you got Because when you get to that part, that shit, it just... Whoo. Yeah, it'll, it'll just boom right in your face. Really? You got to turn the... You got to turn the boot. Mm-hmm. But you know what? I don't know if I can ever do that shit again. I don't drink beer like I used to. Yeah. You know, I can't drink beer because... When you got a high tolerance, beer becomes useless. Exactly, bro. Because you got to drink so much just to mm-hmm. get buzzed. And it, it just gets you bloated. Yeah. <laughs> and you get bloated and you have to go pee like every five seconds. Yeah, I prefer, that's why I prefer it's the hard so stuff. so annoying. I keep telling you, like, I like the hard stuff. I don't... Everybody's like, have a beer, bro. You got some whiskey? Like, I'm not... Whiskey takes you to the point, but with us, it's like, it's just a beer to us. Yeah. It's and, like, nigga, you go be on your 10th beer and you go be barely getting buzzed, like... And, then and I put you, on, like, a thousand calories I'm already. A, I'm on my 10th cup and i'm still buzzing good you yeah. know that's why i was like man if you take three shots back to back to back well at least me if i take three shots back to back to back and then drink a beer i'm straight i think well because beer too is day. mostly to like chill you don't necessarily have to get drunk off it yeah. kind of like when you have your little he actually likes this one beer oh, i was gonna bring it but i didn't know if you're gonna drink it it's i forgot what it's called it's called Melon Cart. Melon Cart by Golden, Golden Road Brewery. Yeah, mm-hmm. I'll bring and it over. he's not I'll a beer person at all. But I don't like drink he beer likes as much this as beer. I used to Remember, I used to drink. I used to drink Stella Trois. Yeah, I don't drink beer anymore, and that's the thing I drink now. If I want to drink a beer, it doesn't taste like beer, but it is beer at the same time. It's hey, actually, I'm it's actually an L. It's actually pretty good. It tastes like watermelon and cantaloupe. Okay. Yeah, it's really. It's good. really good. I'll, let you, I'll bring it next time. I gotta they, try. They only come in six pack. I bring. But it, see, uh, like you drink one and then you or you drink two drink and like you're just and chilling. And That's really what beer is about. But you know, some people like to get fucked up about beer, and that's fine I just, too. Like any, my only goal when I drink any type of alcoholic beverage is to get that buzz. I'm gonna always chase the buzz. Once I get the buzz, I'm straight. I don't want to be drunk. I don't mm-hmm. want to be stumbling. I just want to get that buzz in, and I'm good. But sometimes I overdo it. The thing about this beer, it doesn't get you like, <laughs> it don't make you pee a lot, and it doesn't get you. It doesn't. It's like you drink something just, to, you know, you like you like the taste. You like know? casual, yeah. But it's like I have like one or two. I don't drink like a six pack just to get drunk. I just drink like one or two. Well, he doesn't Do you get, get buzzed drunk. off too. No. Oh, see, then I can't fuck with it. No, no, it's 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 like you enjoy it. Trust me, you enjoy it. It's not something you drink to get drunk off of. It's something you drink to enjoy. And it's not It's not really You're probably thinking It's like fruity-ish it's like, fruity, fruity, like a no, wine it's, cooler it No like, It's not like it's that a, It's like It's an ale basically Okay I see what you're saying you It's got like it, a beer type taste kind It's of? like a beer But it doesn't have The beer type taste You gotta drink it To understand it Like you can taste the beer But then you also get like The melon The, the melon The melon The, the, the honey like the apple water Or what was it called No It's like It's like, like it. It's little like Um the, the angry orchard but it's completely different yeah it's I it's not sweet it's, it's like something a nigga gotta try in order to yeah you understand. have to try it to understand we it we bought like I bought a whole lot so much yeah, like a whole lot they only come in six pack <laughs> they only come in six pack so I bought under a whole lot under the sink is just full of that yeah it's just that and, and his... then uh, I'll drink like one or two I come home from work like oh, I feel like a melon cart today you pop it you drink it when you burp it tastes like watermelon and cantaloupe <laughs> <laughs> I fucks with it. Uh, 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 it's good. It's not it's like it's really good. Uh, oh, it tastes like beer. No, uh, you taste melon. You taste fruits. Hey, it's really good. I think I'm gonna have to try that shit. I'll bring it over. It's hard to find. 
Yeah, we were driving around town looking for this shit. Yeah. We found a place that carries it, but now they're, they're out of stock of it. Like, That's okay. I'll get you some. And you know what? Like, I want to just say I appreciate y'all for like the help that y'all did like, when it came to like that hand sanitizer, the motherfucking... Oh, of course. Uh, the mask. What else? It was something else. Yeah, oh, the drink, the kombucha. Oh, yeah. Like, really I was going to bring you some like today, and I forgot. That shit is a natural energy booster, too. You ever tried it when you're, like, tired? You drink it? Boom. Energy. Well, the blue one. the blue one. The blue one? The one that we gave you because it has blue spirulina in it. It and oxidizes your blood. It, mm. Yeah. So you, you it get natural put energy oxygen from that. in the blood. Okay, yeah, because I've been trying to search for some natural energy because I notice when I do what I do, I go hard for like two weeks, nigga, and I just burn myself out. Mm-hmm. Bro, it's natural energy because it's not, it's not you taking a supplement to get you energy. This is actually, you drink something to help your body oxidize in your bloodstream. So it basically makes more alcohol, not alcohol, but oxygen into your blood. So you get natural energy. I feel you. I noticed because I used I used to drink every or uh, energy drink every single day, one a day, bro. Yeah, I feel you. I've but been I drink the one that's no stop. sugar in it. I drink the no sugar. Still bad for you. One, it's still bad for you. But yeah. I I started drinking the kombucha that she that we brought for you. I noticed the difference. My energy kicks in and boosts. I feel the charge, and you don't get that crash. I feel you. The energy drink don't give you that crash either, but it's you're running off of these. Chemicals, you that know? That shit gave me a crash. It's got vitamins. That's why I switched over to those five hours when I was truck driving. But then that shit had my heart, like, on some weird shit. <laughs> I'm like, my heart not supposed to be making that <laughs> feeling. I don't know. It's scary. Yeah, so that's why I started, like, you know, let me drink. Because that place I went to, there's the place I told you about on uh, Long Beach Boulevard. It's called um, Fine Feather Kombucha. They make one that's... Um, uh, chlorophyll. Chlorophyll. It's algae. I think it was chlorophyll. Kombucha. It's um. Or was it green algae? Was it just green algae? It was. It was. It was just. I don't remember what it was. I, I think. I think it was, it was called, chlorophyll. It was chlorophyll. It was. Um, it was a limited. He only makes it to a certain amount of time, and it, it's a artisan kombucha place. But that shit get me wired to the max, and that shit just is just algae. I gotta try that because I fucks with that. I, bro, I, I it's like it's food. all natural shit, and that shit was skimming. Bro, my body was like, I was like, and it's just natural shit. I got a question, bro. Have you ever uh, tried was it Jamba Juice? What do you think of that? Is that like sugar based? Because I had like no. a power plant energy drink from there. And Jamba I- Juice is more sugar, more like. It's more like a dessert now. It's not anything that I believe the it idea. It was never of it, healthy, to be honest with you. The idea of it yeah, might have been the to influence you that it's healthy, but it's a lot of sugar. Sold in it. to That's you as it. it's healthy because it's a smoothie, but it has so much sugar. As a matter of fact, like when I was in high school, I was always like self conscious about my weight, and after school, I would go have a Jamba Juice. Thinking like, okay, I'm doing great. I got the big one, right? And I'm, I'm having no dinner, just my Jamba Juice. And then when I, now that I'm older, I'm I'm starting to freak out because I'm like, all right, I'm older. Like, I need to be careful. I don't want to get diabetes and I don't want to, you know, like, I just got to take better care of myself. So when we were living in Long Beach, I would go have breakfast, right? And I would always try to find something that's, good for me so i'm like all right i want jamba juice but i know it has a lot of sugar but let me get like one of the healthiest one right so i went i ordered some healthy green thing which was good i liked it but then i was like let me look up the sugar content and stuff that's in it there was like 60 grams of sugar in it shit and i'm like there's no way in fucking hell this is healthy for me this is the first thing I'm putting in my body, and it's 60 grams of sugar. That's a lot. I might as well drink a Coca-Cola yeah, that at that less. point. <laughs> you know, I might as well drink a, what's that shit? You're always like, diabetes in the bottle. The Crush. Might as well oh, go bro, drink me a Crush. Crush, crush is bomb That's as fuck. It's sugar. God damn. It's Wait, got you like sugar. Great Crush? All the that crush. one's bad too. All the crush, I know bro. your mommy loves that one. <laughs> oh, we <me> see. <laughs> it's horrible. Yeah, I was like, Man, my mom fuck with that. It's amazing. It's, it's, it's delicious. So good, I but, know. Ugh. But it's like it the, has so much. I think 
crushes like 65 grams of sugar. Damn. Yeah, and it's like, holy shit. That's I'm talking, but then again, I got like a cranberry juice, and I'm pretty sure that got sugar on top of sugar added. Look at the sugar content. 70. What the fuck? Would it add it, Seth? Yeah. Let it play again. Look at it. 72 and 70, 77 and 76. 72 and 70. Look at it percentage wise. It's crazy. That shit said 142. Bro, yeah. Bro. And that's the bottle. Wow. And even, w- and then, um, wow. not to mention that I got like the small size, I believe. And I was like, oh my God, this is the worst. Like, I might as well just go have like a bagel with light cream cheese somewhere than drink this shit, you know? So, yeah, you do have to be. I mean, every once in a while is good, but. Yeah. Or I would get the kid size. This is how I first found out about it. God damn. My dad loved pineapple soda, you know? Yeah, I do too. And then damn. I saw that, and then when we went to, we was on our way to Vegas. We was at, um, uh, what's that place? Eddie's World? Eddie's World. I turned around all the sodas, and I looked at it. I was like, all of the crushes. It's like, what the fuck? Wow. I'm always trying to get him to drink That's water. That's fucking horrible. Yeah. That's like way over the daily intake of yeah. sugar. Exactly. I was like, yeah. And you wonder why we're so obese. They never showed this before. Remember, they never showed the whole amount before. Now they show the full amount. Remember, yeah. The co- added, uh, yeah. Remember the Coca Cola can was like twenty three percent sugar. Now it's like I want to say seventy five percent sugar. Mm, I don't Damn. know, but hope I know not to go to Jamba Juice no more. Nigga, I stick to my water, my coffee, my green tea, and. If you want to have it, have it occasionally. And if you're going to get anything, get the kid size or get the small one and share it with somebody. That makes sense. <laughs> that's, that what, makes sense. that's what I do. Like, I'll literally, if I get a Jamba Juice because I need something or whatever, um, or there's nothing else for me to get at the moment, I go, I get it. And then I get the small size. I drink half of it and I save the half, um, then the other half for tomorrow. Bro, I cut out a lot. Not of sugar. the best I you know, it's still bad, but at least I cut it in half and I didn't take all of it the same day. I cut out a lot of sugar in my diet. Cause I'm afraid that I might get sick from diabetes, you know, because our dad both had kidney issues, you know? I didn't tell you. Kendrick got diabetes type. Oh yeah, no no, two. you told me. L B got type one. He take the insulin now. LB mm-hmm. take insulin? Mm-hmm. What the fuck? Yeah, that, and he recently found out. It was he he was feeling some type of way. He went to the doctor and found out. So now that nigga take insulin and What was he feeling? Like tired and headaches and stuff like that? I think that's what it was like the I told you that that's and you need to talk to him. I'm telling you, bro, like I I'm really I, like my mama, even Kenya, bro, Kenya weighs two hundred and ten pounds. And she's not even in the ninth grade. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. So, so my mama, she wanted me to go over there and start working out with her or do something. So I told her every Sunday I would go try something, you know. So it's like, I'm trying to get my brother on too, you know what I'm saying? If y'all want to do it, if y'all free on Sundays, like we could Down. figure out something. I mean, like, because that shit's real, bro. Like, I, I don't want to see my brothers. I don't want to see none of, nobody getting Well, getting that's what I'm amputated. saying now that I'm like getting older i'm like oh fuck you know what i mean like all the dumb shit that i did is gonna really catch up hope you know it catches up to you and that's why i, I, I cut, love sweets i've cut out a lot of sugar man you ask her i was like baby that's too sweet i keep telling you this stuff yeah because stuff, I, I told you i started telling you read those damn labels he started flipping labels because i mean i'm not the best at it but you know i I worry about him sometimes too because he gets headaches and um, I want him to go to the doctor but he don't listen to me. Yeah, Best thing you can do, man. I'm just, I just, Probably you just know, want to like take care of ourselves because I want to grow old with him. Yeah. yeah. That's why I stop. I stop like a lot of sugar based stuff. I don't drink water. I don't drink a lot of sugar stuff anymore. If I do drink soda, it'd be zero sugar. Soda, you know? Yeah. But still, you know, soda still could be bad for you. But I drink as much water as I can. I don't drink a lot of sugary products anymore. Like I used drink to. those lacrosse or whatever it's called. Those, Laca- yeah. those are I used to gross. Drink I hate those. those. 
I used to drink those. Those make me mad. I used to drink those, but I also drink the uh, the Waterloo's. The Waterloo's are actually better. The who? The oh, the Waterloo's. Well, you need to get a Waterloo's. Okay. They taste way better than the Cross. Water leaf. Waterloo. Waterloo. Oh, I gotta. Like L O O. They're so way wait, better. Bro. What flavor of the other stuff do you drink? See, all of them. I drink the uh, the green one. What's like the... your favorite one? What flavor? I like the. Damn, it start with a P. What is that? Peach. Flavor? You know, it's not peach. Oh. It's, I can't remember, but it started with a P. It's not pineapple. It's like a different pomegranate or some shit like that. Pomegranate. pomegranate? I think that's what it is. It's like pomegranate. Does Waterloo have, have a pomegranate I think water, one? Waterloo has a mm-hmm. pomegranate mm-hmm. one. You get, you find Waterloo at um, Mother's and Whole Food. Okay. Yeah. And they're delicious, bro. Like they're really good. Try those next. Yeah, at, we used to buy like packs, six no packs. No sugar, though, right? Like no, nothing. it's no. Like it's water, right? it's. it's Sparkling sure. water. And sparkling water is the same thing like uh, the La Croix, but way tastes way better, bro. Yeah, I, I like them way better than the La Croix. I used to drink those. She she knows, I drink those like crazy, and she's like, "Hey, I can't. You get me drink like that? I don't like those." I get mad because I'm like, it's unfinished soda. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> hey, my brother had to wake, and I was like thirsty. Like, yeah, I brought him that. Then he went, "What the? Fuck yeah. is this? I was like, Where the oh. fuck is the sugar?" <laughs> Like, nigga, I thought I was gonna taste some sodas. Like I taste the bubbly acid, but I yeah. didn't taste no flavor. Like, what the I don't like those, but Waterloo, I can. Waterloo you know, is pretty good. I wanted to like kind of drink it every day because I'm like, this is okay. Like I kind of enjoy it better, but I I can't. I can't. I'm just like, bro. I drank it every soda. day. I drank it every day. Waterloo, yeah. Before, yeah. Waterloo, I drank it every day. We haven't got any more. No, we haven't. But I used to get a lot of them. I leave them in the trunk and I drink them like crazy. Hey. I drink them at work, like just. Shit, if it works, you know what I'm yeah. saying? If it don't have nothing it in it. It curves your craving of sugar. I'm not sugar, soda. But at the same time, it tastes pretty good. When it's really cold, it tastes really yeah, good. Yeah, that yeah. And that's what it is, because I just drunk like two in the morning. Yeah. Mm. You know what I'm saying? It was like, when they're the cold, they hurt. Huh? When they're cold, they hurt. They hurt, but they do. It's good. like, oh, take them down, what like, the fuck? You know Why what they, is it hurting me? You know what they remind me of? <laughs> It remind me of Coca Cola, how it hurts. Yeah. Oh, man, yeah. oh, but you know what? I love a Sprite that fucking makes like is slowly killing me when I drink it. Like, <laughs> oh, I can't breathe, but it's good. It yeah. It's probably that goddamn diabetes <laughs> going down your throat. If you ever try the, the Waterloo, the mango one is good. She loves the mango. Oh, one. that's what I like too. The mango. Yeah. The mango, mango Waterloo yeah. is good. The watermelon Waterloo is good. The, the black Fourth of July thing they came the out Fourth with, of July one, which is like berries. It, it's really good. It's I actually like, liked it. It's like a berry mix, raspberry, blueberry. It tastes really good. What? Matter of fact, what time is it? We could go get some. After, nah, it's still. It's probably closed now. I'm going to have to look into something like that. Let me see. I'll show you what it looks like so you know. And it, got, it seemed like it got more of a flavor selection than the other one. No, they're about the same amount, I think, in flavors. But it's just... It's really tasty. Well, everybody, I don't know if this camera is dead or if it's alive, but <laughs> we're about to go unlive in this motherfucker if the camera's still working. Yeah. I don't know if the camera's still working, but hey, you know what? You know, uh, <laughs> thank y'all for sticking around if you stuck around this long. You know, and, and sharing these memories, and you know, of course, with the Bros Podcast. If you don't, if this is your first time on here, as you can see, like, like we we have subjects, our main subjects that we have, but then we also go we around also the world and around. come full circle. You know, so you know, I, I appreciate y'all for sticking around, and you know, if you know anything about that, or you know, if you made a positive impact on your life, or hell, if you made a negative impact on your life, you beat sure. your ass or something, you little cry baby. <laughs> no, but, <laughs> sure. you know, yeah, share it, man. Share it below. You know, like. You know, show some love, show some report, uh, report, show some love, show some support. You know what I'm saying? And stay motivated and elevated, man. This is this, this is that day. The rare breed. This is his birthday. This is a special day for him. This is how we celebrate it in his memory. Yes, sir. Happy birthday, Dad. And more to come. Yep, more to come. Much love, bro. Always a part of our life. Regulator for life. Regulator for life. D A A. Don't day, forget to like and comment. And hit the subscribe button. There we go. Because I never say that shit. I never say. I got to get on that. Hey, you are with the bros, and thank you for watching. Thank you. Bye. What's up, man? Oh, my God. Oh, my God.
my gosh. Oh, oh, man. So long. Oh, oh, wrong. Man. Wow. Anything goes with the bros.